Shalom. I like to start. Uh, we like to start off by giving our praise to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai. Double honors to the apostles of Great Millstone. Salutations to Yaakim out here pushing the work of truth and sincerity. And Shalom to you, a few sisters uh, that are learning and watching. Okay. Um, and yeah, man, we're gonna go into uh, uh, this lesson, you know, exposing uh, this devil, man, because in, until Yahweh Shai comes back, all right, who the world only calls Jesus Christ, you know. These prophecies uh, still need to be uh, um, put, uh, spoken of, man. Because the scripture says, man, uh, how shy is the spirit of prophecy? So, you know, we're going to go into, you know, Esau, Edom, which is uh, you, you white people, you, you Edomites, you uh, you Caucasians, man, you cave dwellers, all right? Whatever you want to call it, Europeans. All right? Right. Because that, that's what you really are, man. Y'all Edomites, man, y'all came, y'all descent from Esau, all right? Which is uh, your forefather, and you guys, you guys dwell in caves, man, and in the cliffs of the rock, like the scriptures speak about, man. So, you know? and then, then uh, the Lord gave you you devils, all right, the dominion, all right, because He says He 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 uh, uh, chooses the basis of men, all right, mm -hmm. to rule in the, in the earth, all right, and then you you guys are ruling now, man. All right, yeah. this is your kingdom. All right, the earth was given to the hands to you guys, so yeah, man, we're going to you guys right now. Okay, this is uh, the scripture that the brother was speaking about in the beginning. Okay. It's uh, 2 Thessalonians chapter 2, verse 3. It says, Let no man deceive you by any means that the day that day shall not come except there be a falling away first. Right. You know, and, and we already fell away, man. The Israelites, they be, they've been falling away, uh, you know, because this is during the time of after Yahweh, man, our Savior. You know, and what happened in 70 AD, they, they ransacked the temple and then uh, the Israelites lost their identity, man. You know, as it's written in Jeremiah uh, 17 and 4, man. Uh, you know, I'll just read it real quick. It's Jeremiah 17 and 4. And and thou even thyself shall discontinue from thy heritage that I gave thee, and I will cause thee to serve thy enemies in a land that thou knowest not. For ye have kindled a fire in my anger, which shall burn forever. Right, you know, and that was that great final way, man, serving our enemies, man. <clears throat> kind. Yeah, it says even thou and thyself should go into captivity. So we we went, we went under uh, so-called white man took us down mm -hmm. in seventy A.D. and that was the starter of our of, of our downfall, man. Kind. You know, we lost everything. All right, scripture says we should be without priests, without a king. All right, because that 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 was uh, uh, the fire, the great fire in the way, man. All right. Kind. I got another real quick one. Hey, Shemaiah, baby. Uh, it's uh, Baruch chapter 3, uh, verse of uh, chapter 2. This is the book of Baruch chapter 2, verse 30. For I knew that they would not hear me because it is a stiff necked people, but in the land of their captivities they shall remember themselves, man. Yeah. So, backing up that Jeremiah, the scriptures tell us that uh, Israel was going to lose their heritage, but in the land of their captivity they were going to remem remember themselves, man. And that's exactly what's happening right now, man. You know, uh, uh, so-called blacks, uh, Latinos, and Native Americans are finding out that they're the real Hebrew Israelites, man. You know? And, and, and on top of that, uh, uh, the world is finding out who Esau Edom is, man. That man of sin, the man of perdition. You know? Uh, yeah, because... And, yeah. and then you go to the curses. It says that these, these, shine, these, these should be a, 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 as a, a, a sign, all right, for, to know uh, who, who are these... You know, the Israelites, man. They should remember ourselves. Uh, you Kyle. know, we should look back and remember. You, you know, what the Lord when the Lord curses them. And I can't find it. You know, it, it's a Deuteronomy twenty-eight. I will not. I'll get it right now. Uh, it's a. Uh, uh, right. They should be. A, they should be a sign unto you, man. Sign and a wonder, right? To lock it. Bear with us. Uh, it's in the curses. Um, kind of, you know, but while he gets that, I'm gonna read this this scripture right here. This is um the book of Hosea, chapter one, verse ten. It says, Ye, uh, "Yet the number of the children of Israel shall be as the sand of the sea, which cannot be measured nor numbered, and it shall come to pass that in the place where it was said unto them." Ye are not my people, there it shall be said unto them, ye are the sons of the living God, man. You know, because what do they call us now, man? They call us so-called blacks, uh, uh, which which that's a, a, an offensive word, man, for, for you so-called Negroes, man. That, that should be offensive, man. The word black means void of light, man. You know what I'm saying? 
uh, it, it means darkness. You know, it it it, it just brings bad uh, uh, connotations to you, man. It's it's a color, man. Here it is. You're calling your whole uh, 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 nation, your whole country, a, a, a color, man. You know, and the same thing goes uh, for, for you uh, Latinos and, and Native Americans, man. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, uh, what do they call you? Uh, spicks, uh, wetbacks. You know, they think that we're shit, man. They think that we're the bottom of the people, man. But here in this place, they should say that we're the sons of the living God, man. Right. You know? Right. So hey, right now we're under these curses like we just read. And uh, we call all kinds of names, man. We call it bywords, proverbs, man. You know, like your brother said, man, we, we, we are called all these different names. But except our real uh, identity, man, which is uh, being Israelites, man. You know? Particularly us, man, so-called Mexicans, y'all Issacharites, all right? So the tribe of Issachar, all right? Because uh, Jacob had, what, 12 sons, man? And each son that each son had a, 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 a particular tribe, man, and that's how we descend from, man. All right, but the scripture says, man, all, all the foundations are out of course, man. So everything's all upside down. We don't know, you know, there's a veil over us, all right? The scripture says, uh, uh, you know, he's going to cast a veil that is spread over our nations, man. That veil is being revealed, man, through who? Through the prophets, man. Yeah, All right. and I got that Deuteronomy you mentioned. Come. It's uh, Deuteronomy chapter 28, verse 45. It says, Moreover, all these curses shall come upon thee, and shall pursue thee and overtake thee, till thou be destroyed. Hey, our people are destroyed right now, man. You got our own people killing each other, man. Right. And, but, but as soon as a so-called white guy passes by, the thuggest-ass dude shuts his damn mouth, man. Puts his fucking hands in his pockets, man. Right. Remember, you're killing our own people, man. Fucking bullshit. All right. Because it, it says uh, people are destroyed for lack of knowledge, man. That's the main reason why we destroyed, man. Because the Lord took the knowledge from us, man. All right? And we were destroyed, what? Physically through the plantation era. All right? When we were uh, 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 um, working, uh, being hardcore slaves, man, under this devil. All right? But then, you know, for a certain period of time, the Lord had it that we were free all right, from that. So, so, so these prophecies could be fulfilled, man. All right, so this is all the game of you. How about Shimmy Al Shai, man? This is all his plan, man. This is all, he has an agenda, man. Kind all right, so, so I'm, I'm going to keep going here. Kind of, kind of. It says, um, Till thou be destroyed, because thou hast hearkened not unto the voice of Yahweh, thy power, to keep his commandments and his statutes, which he commanded thee, man. You know, and, and that's what's going to save us, man. It's going, coming back unto him, repenting for the, for the wicked shit that we've done, and coming back unto him, man, according to us, in spirit and in truth, man. Uh, uh, verse 46 this is the point. And they shall be upon thee for a sign and for a wonder upon thy seed forever, man. So Damn. that was promised unto Israel, man, uh, that, that it was going to be for a sign to know who the real Israelites were, man. When when it talks in Jeremiah, when they lost their heritage, uh, that's how you were going to know who we, who they were, man. All right. It said from your seed forever and ever, man. Yeah. So, hey, that seed is still here on the earth, man. Con right. if, I, if I could say another thing. Con uh, um, that's also, it's, it's a good way to tell amongst you heathens because Israel was scattered all abroad of the four corners of the earth, man. And we suffer what's called confusion of faces, man. You know, going back to Deuteronomy, uh, uh Daniel's nine and seven, man. Man, wasn't Satan, bro. You know, you know, but, but that's what it is, man. You know, uh, our people suffer from confusion of face. So even amongst the heathens, if you're going through it, and you believe in your how about Shimmy Shai, you this this word resonates with you, then you then you uh more than likely you're an Israelite, man. You know? So uh it's so like I'm, we're gonna go back to this uh, Thessalonians. Con, con. Um uh, unless you got something. Nah, you know? nah, nah, I'm 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 on you. Con, con. This uh second Thessalonians two and two and three again. Let no man deceive you by any means that that day should not come except there come a falling away first, and we fell away already, man. We're we're we're, get, we're getting ready to uh, raise, we're raising up the breaches right now, man. So that day is approaching, man. This is that day won't come to great falling away. So we, we, the, the day is near, man. Huh. Right. It says, and that man of sin be revealed, the son of perdition, man. Son of perdition, so, the son of destruction. Yep. All right, which is uh, what Esau, man. He's, uh, Habakkuk two and five says what he he enlarges his his uh, his uh. Damn. Kind of because the thing moves. He enlarges uh, his, um, well, he says that he's a boy of the wicked, but he says he enlarges his, uh, I'm going to get it, man, because I, I can't, I can't remember the top of my head. Uh, well, you know, that that, that, that man got to be revealed, man. 
that's that's also something that needs to pa- happen, and it's being happening right now, man. You have all these other nations uh, um, that, that that are looking uh, against the so-called white man. They look. Right. They, he's being revealed on all sides, man. That he that the way that he rules his king kingdom is through deceit and and and, and lies upon lies and murder, man. Uh, is a uh, Habakkuk two and five. Yeah, also because he transgresses with wine, he is a proud man. Neither keep it at home, who enlarges his desire as hell, and is as death, and cannot be satisfied, but gather unto him all nations, all nations, and heap it unto himself all people. Yep. And now, who fits that description, man? Who who goes uh, uh, who, uh, uh, around the world, man, policing everybody, setting up their uh, 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 embassies, right. all right, military bases, right. all right, and, 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 and the angry, and, the, and gathering all nations, man. It says he enlarges his borders as hell, man. His desire as hell, man. So he puts those military bases everywhere, and, and what happens every time he gets there, man? Death follows, man. All right, death follows this devil, man. Hey, John 10 and 10, man. The thief coming not, but to steal, kill, and to destroy, man. That's right, man. You know? You so, know. Uh, uh, so yeah, he, he said he transgresses with wine, man. Uh, who, 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 how, how does he transgress with wine? There's a, a Jeremiah 51. Huh. All right, this is 51. Because now we're going to go into Esau, man. This is Jeremiah 51, and uh, I'm going to start at uh, uh, 7. It says, Babylon has been a golden cup in the Lord's hand. Right. All right, and made all earth drunken. The nations have drunken on for wine, therefore the nations are mad. <laughs> all right. He heap it to him all nations, man, and the nations are mad, man. Why? Because he pushes all his, his philosophies, his agendas, man, his wickedness. All right. You know, over there in the Middle East, man, uh, uh, the uh, the Arabs, man, you know, everybody, all those uh, 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 Hebrew uh, nations, man, are are pissed off, man. All right, because all, all the bullshit that that, that America uh, pushes into their into uh, their societies, man. Yep. Hey, who who who's the leader of the so-called free world, man? He, uh, the so-called white man. He 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 has heaped himself all these people, man. What they call uh, uh, so-called America, which is really Babylon. That's right. who that's talking about, right. you know. Uh, um, you know, modern day Babylon. Um, uh, w- w- what do they call this place? They say it's a, it's a culture, uh, 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 a, c- a cultural melting pot, man. Because you got nations from all o- all over the world here uh, uh, together, man. You know, and, and go- going back to the Tower of Babel, that's not what the Most High intends, man. He gave he separated every every nation, man. It's not so that everybody could come together and be all cool, man. You know, right. uh, I'm gonna keep going as Thessalonians because it, it actually exposes Esau, man. The Second Thessalonians two and four. Now it's talking about the son of uh, uh, son of uh, perdition, verse four, who opposed and exalted himself above all that is called God, or that is worshipped, man. And, and that's the first thing this man does, man. Every time we're out there in the highways and the byways preaching, they're they're the only people that walk that, that walk by and throw out the bop from it, man. You know. They were with their hands, man. You know, I, hey, man. It's the nature of the, this devil, man. Yeah, they, they they come out with these bogus theories, uh, the Big Bang Theory, uh, 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 evolution, all to shit on uh, 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 giving glory unto the our Father, man, Yahweh and His Son, Yahweh Shai, man. You know, he always got he was, he always got to say, oh no, it's an other explanation, man. You know, uh, I'm gonna keep going. It says. Um, or is worship so that he as the most high sit, sitteth in the temple of, of the most high showing himself that he is God man and sure. and, and, and did he not change the image uh, of our father into a pale faced cracker man when, when the scriptures clearly tell you that he's a man of color man that he said the ancient of days his arms uh, uh, were, were as uh, uh, was it, it said bronze, right? Yeah, hey, bronze. Yeah, uh, you know, well, we read in the Spanish, right, right. And the Spanish says bronze, man. You know, right, right. And uh, and in Revelations one and thirteen, it says that the sun, uh, well, his feet was into fo- polished brass, man. It's a derivative of brown, bro. Yeah. And and then the ain't same, no no cracker, man. Right, in the same way uh, Ezekiel described the the, cher- the angels, man. I uh, they, they were bronze bronze color, man. A, a color of beryl. Which is a, a derivative of, of brown man, dark skin. All right. right. Uh, um, yeah, and, and uh, I got you. I got a piece for you because you said uh, he changed the image mm-hmm. of the Lord, man. This drove real quick, man. You know, it, it, uh, 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 
Job 9 and 24. That says, um, come, come. It says, the earth is given into the hand of the wicked. All right, who is the wicked? Malachi 1 and 3. Man, Esau, Edom, the man we're exposing right now. It says, the earth is given to the hand of the wicked. He covereth the faces of the judges thereof. If not, where and who is he? So who, who, who's a man who... who 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 said who 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 ruled during the Renaissance period, man? During the iconoclasm, man. Esau, man, the so-called white man. He was the one who covered the faces of the judges, man, with with, with, with painting of the dark images and putting them white, man. Yep. All right. Kind of. So uh, this sad man, man. I'm gonna jump into Second Thessalonians two to verse four. You had more on there, bro? Nah, that's it on that. That's it on that. Kind of. Verse eight. It says, "And then shall the wicked be revealed, whom the Lord shall consume with the spirit of his mouth." And shall destroy with the brightness of his coming. And that's us, man. The spirit of his mouth is us, man. He's right. putting the spirit upon us, his prophets, to come out of here and, and bring forth his word, man. You right. know? And that's what that's what's coming, man. You know? Um, we uh, brother mentioned this one before. Come. We'll bring it out. Come, Bible show. This is Daniels 4 and 17. This matter is by the decree of the watchers and, and the demand by the word of the holy ones to the intent that the living may know that the most high rule is in the kingdom of men. And giveth it to whomsoever he will, and set it over up, uh, up up over it the bases of men. Right. You know the bases of men, man. My brother I, just read the job, man. Right. Uh, the <laughs> yeah. this is given to the hand of the wicked, right? Okay. Hey, starting with Alexander the Crete, man. He was a base man. All right. They, they were, it says they were driven among men into caves, man. When you read the book of Job, it speaks about how they were uh, 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 they were uh, they were speaking like like an ass, man. They had no language, all right? It says they, they, they braided in the bushes, something like that. Yeah, yeah, so, they braided hey, in the bushes. Yeah, so that, that, that the, you know, whenever you see uh, uh, Esau uh, making movies about uh, cavemen, it, it's really talking about them, man. That's how they live, bro. Hey. They say they start, they're the beginning of society. Nah, man, so there's always, there's ways, greater societies, man, and empires than this one, man. Right, but just when the, but the pride of this devil, man, he, he, wants, to, he wants to take all credit, man. Yeah. Right. Hey, you, the brother mentioned Alexander. Here, here is your Alexander right here, man. For you prideful ass Edomites, man. This is uh, the book of First Maccabees one and one, and it happened after that Alexander, son of Philip the Macedonian, who came out of the land of Shittim, was smit, uh, had smitten Darius, king of the per Persians and Medes, and he reigned in his stead, the first over Greece. All right, and this is and this is history, man. Coming straight out the Bible, man. You know, this is accepted history that that after the Persian Empire came came the Greeks, man. Uh, Alexander, we're gonna jump into verse ten. Let's see, let's see what it says. The one. Oh, that yeah, when he was multiply. Yeah, yeah. Oh, huh. uh, verse nine. Uh, you know, see what happens when he came into authority. Uh, I'm gonna read seven. So Alexander reigned twelve years and then died, and his servants bear rule everyone in his place. After his death, they all put crowns upon themselves. So did their sons after them uh, many years and evils were multiplied in the earth, man. Uh. So you, you Edomites are, are, are fucking evil, man. Uh. You, you guys can't do right, man. Y'all uh. are can't do right nation, man. Uh. Back you up real quick. It's Proverbs 28, verse the, um, 20, 12, uh. I'm sorry, I'm going to read 28. This is a good one. When the wicked rise, men hide themselves, but when they perish, righteousness increase. Now, there's, yep. yeah, so the righteous, yep. as Scripture says, uh, 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 truth has been hid, hid for so long. All right, but yep. the truth is coming out, man. And ri righteousness is going to rule, man, the planet Earth, man. Uh, but uh, there's a scripture that speaks about when the wicked uh, 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 bear rule. Yeah, yeah, uh, transgressions increase, man. Uh, but, uh, you know, the people mourn. I think it's that same chapter. Uh, but you know, that, that's, that's Esau, man. Now, uh, we know that Esau, when we go into Genesis, it speaks about him getting the, the, the blessing of the sword, man. All right? This is the man who got the blessing of the sword, man. All right? He's ruling the planet Earth with the sword. All right? 29 and 2. Well, it's a proper 29. Because it says, oh, what? Wickedness increase, man. Oh. Uh, yeah, it says, when the righteous are in authority, people rejoice. And Proverbs 29 and 2, when the righteous are in authority, the people rejoice. But when the wicked bear rule, the people mourn. Yep. All right? And the whole uh, state of the earth is, is mourning, man. All right? Why? Because this man of sin is ruling, man. 
uh, uh, this, right. this man of perdition. That's what the word means. Destruction, man. Right. And here it is. You know, this man has the whole, uh, like the whole earth, uh, 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 working for pieces of paper, man. You know, when back in the days people traded and bartered, man, they had real money, man. They had gold and silver. You know, right now uh, he has these people uh, slaves to corporations, man, doing jobs that they don't even want to do, man. Ha having people go to school uh, 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 20 plus years to, to get a job that then is not even uh, the same thing that they were going to school for, man. You know, it, everything in this society is, is messed up, man, because of corruption, uh, uh, corrupt dealings, man. I found the scriptures is a Proverbs 29 and 16. When the wicked are multiplied, transgressions increase, but the righteous see her, but the righteous shall see their fall, man. I, it says, blessed is the man who sees the fall of his enemies, man. All right, don't, the righteous men are those that are standing in great boldness against the, uh, uh, with, against the them that afflicted them, man. Wisdom is in the fifth chapter. So who are those great men, man? All right, do, starting with the men of the apostles of Great Millstone, man, who are or preordained, all right, from Yahweh Bashim Shai, man, to be the prophets, man. Mm -hmm. All right, to exp these are the only men are, uh, exposing this devil, man. He right. says, I'll read it again. When the wicked are multiplied, transgressions increase, but the righteous will see their fall, man. That's a beautiful scripture, man, because it, it, that describes the, the state of, of the earth right now, man. Um, um, I got a scripture. Okay. This is uh, the book of Malachi, chapter 1, verse... Two, I'm going to read from the top. The burden of the word of Yahweh to Israel by Malachi. I have loved you, saith Yahweh. Yet he said, Wherein hast thou loved us? Was not Esau Jacob's brother, saith Yahweh? Yet I loved Jacob, and I hated Esau. You know, so that tells you right there the Lord doesn't love everybody, man. Yeah, the Lord hates, man. He's a balanced power, man. Exactly. It's just way this is delight. I right. can't. What? That's it, man. And laid his mountains, and I hated Esau, and laid his mountains and his heritage waste for the dragons of the wilderness. Uh -huh. Whereas Edom saith, We are impoverished, but we will return and build the desolate places. Thus saith Yahweh of hosts, They shall build, but I will throw down, and they shall call them the border of wickedness. The border of wickedness, man. It, it, Then we read, uh, He enlarges his border as hell? Yeah, border as hell, man. You know? That's the wicked who was given a, a dominion over the earth, man. Esau, Edom. When, when Alexander, we just read it, when he when he was uh, multiplied, did not evils were multiplied? Yeah. He is the border of wickedness, man. Hey, but it says, I will build, man, and but we will throw down. I will throw down. The Most High is from the, he built this whole empire, all right, it's, it's, uh, uh, with, with the skyscrapers in Chicago, New York, you look at it, it looks like a, a empire, right? Mm -hmm. And the Lord's going to destroy all that, man. Mm -hmm. Yep. It says, The border of wickedness and the people against whom Yahweh has indignation forever, man. So here it is, straight up the Bible is letting you know that the Most High has one set of people that he hates forever, man. And it's, his name is Esau. You know? The, the Edomites, Esau in the Bible, are hated forever, man. Now, now, now let's go to Genesis 25 and let's see how this this uh, Edomite, Esau, looks, man. Right, right. You know? This is Genesis uh, 25 and uh, 23. Uh, and the Lord said unto her, Two nations are in thy womb, and two manner of people shall be separated from their bowels, and one people shall be stronger than the other people, and the elder shall serve the younger. This is talking about when Jacob and Esau were twins in the womb, man. Verse twenty four, and when her days to be fulfilled were, uh, when when her days to be delivered were fulfilled, behold, there were twins in her womb, and in, and the first came out red all over like a hairy garment, and they called his name Esau, man. So he just described how he looked, man. Now, if, if everybody everybody was coming, what slack here? Why why they had to need to describe right uh, uh, Esau coming out red like a hairy garment? Why didn't why didn't why didn't the, the, the scripture uh, describe uh, Jacob when he came out, man? Right. All right, because everybody was was dark skin at the time, man. So there was no need for to to describe Jacob's color, man. There was no need. Everybody was brown at the time, man. Mm -hmm. You know, and it was until uh, uh, Esau came about. You know, here it is. Look at look at the majority of the world, man. The majority of the world is is, is dark skinned people, man. Brown people. They get browner when the sun hits them, man. You know, that's but, pigment, man. That's melanin. Exactly, right, that, man. Hey, that, that's in your DNA, man. But, so, but, so why did the so-called white man, the only group of nation, 
that does that that, that was stricken off their melanin, man. Because because the Lord put a curse on them, man. The, mm -hmm. the curse of leprosy. Exactly, man. You know. Can you so, read that again? Uh, yeah, and it says it came out red. Why? Because because there's no pigment to cover his blood. That you know, so they're translucent, man. You could see it. Huh. That's what it meant. Uh, you, you see a baby Edomite born. He's red as fuck, man. Huh. It says, and the first came out red all over like a heavy garment, and they called his name Esau. And it says the the, the elder should serve the younger, man. Mm -hmm. All right? It says the first shall be last, and the last should be first. Right now we're at last, man. Why? Because our, our oldest brother, Esau, he's ruling the planet Earth right now, man. Yep. But the scripture says, man, Esau is the end of the world, or the end of this age, the, den the end of this empire, and Jacob is the beginning of it that followeth, man. Yep. All right? Yeah, well, we can get that, too. Shit. Con yeah. Um. I'm going to just read another description of Esau. Okay. This is Genesis 27 and 34, 38. Salakia, 38. Uh, Genesis chapter 27, verse 38. And Esau said unto his father, Has thou but one blessing, my father? Bless me, uh, even me also, O my father. And Esau lifted up his voice and wept. And Isaac, his father, answered and said unto him, Behold, thy dwelling shall be the fatness of the earth and the dew of the heaven from above. And, that, and they're living deliciously right now, man. This falls upon, this prophecy fits them, man. They live deliciously, man. If you see some of these Edomites, these white people, man, they, they're living good, man. Every day eating fine steaks, eating the freshest of food, living in high-rises, like beautiful, uh, luxurious places, you know? And he, But even at that, man, our kingdom is going to be way times, uh, seven times, seven times, seven uh, 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 better and, and, and more glorious than this, man. But that's that's another point, right. you know? But just the... Right, and we go to Revelation, speak about the harlot, man, who who who, who uh, live deliciously, man. Yep. That's that queen, man, that says, I will, I will see no, I will be no widow, man. Yep. All right. They, we said they live out the fatness of the earth. Like, we just, we read, they, they enlarge their borders as hell. Why? To get all the resources from all these different places, man. They're trying to gain up all the resources of the world, man. This man can't be satisfied. Kind of, so, yeah, I'll get it real quick. It's, yeah. uh... Uh, Revelations 18 and 19. And the kings of the earth who had committed fornication and lived deliciously with her. All right, we just, we just say he heaped between all nations, man. All right. It's just, uh, uh, um, and it says, uh, 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 she, I'll read it again. And the king of the earth who had committed fornication and lived deliciously with her shall beware her, be, bewail her, Salakia, and lament for her when they shall see the smoke of her burning, man. <laughs> This is gonna happen, man. Yeah, man. The Lord's gonna destroy this place through plagues, man, famine, earthquakes, all right, uh, 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 hurricanes, man. All of this is already happening, man. But ultimately, what? The second death is coming, man. Which is a uh, ICBM nuclear missiles, man, huh. in this place, man. That lake of fire. Huh. Hey, and, and and by this too, verse forty. You know, uh, you know this. This is one of the reasons, uh, main reasons why he's gonna get destroyed, man. Verse uh -huh. forty. And by thy sword thou shalt live, and shall serve thy brother, which, uh, and shall serve thy brother, man. That's what you guys do. You guys live by your sword, man. You know the the military budget in this place it, uh, uh, supersedes anything else, man. You know, right. uh, the, these guys, uh, man, they're prideful with with their military, man. If they don't have a big military, they can't be cool, man. And while the majority of their veterans, man, are, are homeless, man. Right. See, that's the that's that's the, yet again, man. Uh, this devil being wicked, man. Okay. Well, he is the wicked. All okay. right. Uh, I got one more. It says Isaiah fourteen and twelve. Okay, it says, "How art thou fallen from heaven, O Lucifer, son of the morning? How art thou cut down to the ground, which which did weakens the nations, man? Mm -hmm. Who who, who weakens the nations, man? Who put fear in all the nations? All right, through it through his uh, military, man." Uh, America, man, Esau. Mm -hmm. All right. Hey, what happened when uh, when uh, when um, the, the two atomic bombs were thrown down in uh, the islands of Japan, man? In Nagasaki and Hiroshima, man. All right. The whole the whole earth was quiet, man. Well, it yep. says here. It says here. For he for thou hast said in thy heart, I will ascend into heaven. I will exalt my throne above the stars of Yahweh. I will sit also upon the mount of the congregation in the side of the north. It says, I will ascend above the heights of the cloud. I, I will be like the most high, man. That's why he has that international space station, man. Mm -hmm. he, 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 This guy wants to be God, but has no wisdom and understanding to be so, man. All right. It says, yet thou shalt be brought down to hell to the sides of the pit. And that's what's coming to you, so-called white people, man. Yep. All of you, man. Uh, you should keep going, because it's going gonna, it's gonna to explain yeah. that Lucifer is talking about a man. Right, verse 16. 
they that see thee shall narrowly look upon thee and consider thee, saying, Is this the man? The man. Right. Is this the man that made the earth to tremble? That this shake kingdoms? All right. Hey, the earth was quiet after those, nuclear, uh, those atomic bombs were thrown down, man. Yep. Hey, and that's why the nations, uh, the scripture says that the nations are mad, man. Mm -hmm. And But, hey, the prophecy is fulfilling where it says, uh, 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 let, the, let, the, let the weak say I'm strong, man. Because yep. these nations are, get, are, 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 are are catching up to this devil, man. Hey, uh, uh, North Korea has nuclear missiles, man. Iran has nuclear missiles, man. Yeah, that little-ass uh, peninsula uh, is flexing on America right, right. now, man. You know, King Jong-un, you know, he got he took in his pose, man. He, they're not scared, man. These nations out here aren't scared. Yeah, man, you know? Amer America's through, man. All right, just a couple more prophecies got to be fulfilled, man. The chip, Esau has to bring the chip already, man. All right. right. And then, and then after that, man, all hell's going to break loose, man. And only the men of the Lord who endure to the end, man, are going to be saved, man. Come. Well, I got like, this last scripture. We're going to finish off with this. Come, come. This is the book of Revelation, chapter 11, verse 18. That's the, the spirit, man, because I was holding that one, too. <laughs> come. Hey, and there's a spirit. This brother just said it. And the, it says, and the nations were angry, and thy wrath is come, man. See? They're angry. <laughs> All these nations are angry, man. Well, who? Well, Esau keeps angering. The, the scriptures always speak about this man angering the nations, man. Why? Because he's a damn devil, man. Yeah. You know? And it says, and, and the time of the dead that they shall be judged, and that thou shouldest give reward unto thy servants, the prophets, man. That's coming too, man. You uh, Israelites, how we started the lesson. You know, they figure out that you guys are Israelites and come back into the law, statutes, and commandments of the Most High. In spirit and in truth, uh, uh, um, hey man, and those who are doing the work, pretty much talking about the prophets, who are doing the work, who are pushing out the videos, who are being strong in the faith, you know, those guys are going to get rewarded, man, you know, right. with, with, with what? The kingdom, man, you know, it says in uh, Revelations 2, man. Um, right, it says, uh, it says that he's not righteous to forget our labor of love, man. Right, I'm going to read Revelations 2 real quick, Revelations 2 and 5, but that which ye have already hold fast till I come. This truth, man, hold it fast. And he that over and he that overcometh and keepeth my works unto the end, to him will I give power over the nations, man. You know? It says, And he shall rule them with a rod of iron, as the vessels of a potter shall they be broken to shivers, even as I received of my father, man. That's right. So 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 the, that's what the reward for the prophets is gonna be, man. The kingdom, man. All right, we're gonna join heirs with Yahweh Shai, man. To rule yeah. over these nations, man. Yeah, right. join heirs with Yahweh Shai, right. man. Because right, uh, I was given by those that were given by, I was given by my father, man. It says, "Ask for me, and I'll give you the the heathen for the inheritance, man." Bro, and, and it's gonna be beautiful, man. It's not gonna be this wicked ass shit Esau has set up, man. You know, it's gonna be all done in righteousness, you know, and it's gonna be glorious, man. I, I got another scripture, Romans eight and nineteen, for the earnest expectation of the creature waiteth, and that's talking about all creatures, man. Right, right. Waiteth for the manifestation of the sons of Yahweh of God, man. Right, because we read, man, uh, when the wicked are in the story, the people uh, uh, mourn, man. That's why all, 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 even all these heathens, man, want want Israel to rule on the planet Earth, man. Hell yeah, because we're gonna be ruling in righteousness, man. Mm -hmm. You know, and 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 and, and we're gonna check y'all wickedness, man. You know, we're not gonna let uh, 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 wickedness uh, 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 keep running uh, wild, man. You know. Shit, um, matter of fact, um, I would just bring out, you bring out that Sirach 10 and 8? Okay. Sirach 10 and 8. Yeah. Because, you know, this is what's happening, man. This is the result of, of living so wickedly, man. Okay. got it. Sirach 10 and 8. Because of unrighteous dealings and injuries and riches got by deceit, the kingdom is translated from one people to another. Okay. And, and, that, and that's what, the, and this is how this devil uh, uh, got this land, man. Through robbery, murder, mm -hmm. riches got by deceit, fraud, mm -hmm. all right, and lying to their own people, all right, all right, uh, uh, putting us in slavery. That that is how, this is how the, the kingdom or this uh, was translated to them, man. Yep. And, and when the son, when the sons of God are, are manifested, everything's gonna be righteous, man. The the, the even even the earth is not gonna be uh, crying no more, man. You yeah. know, everything's no. gonna yield and and, and bountiful, man. Because we're gonna give the land Sabbath. We're going to give the, the land to rest, man. Well, you know, everything's going to be ruled in the balance, man. 
Right. You know? Before that, all that could come in. This place got to be destroyed, man. Yep. So, Scripture says in Ezra that the the the, when the, the, the the good seed cannot be planted, uh, at least the evil evil seed is rooted out, man. Uh. So, hey, Scripture says that uh, reward her even as she rewarded us, man. So everything the so-called white man, the Caucasians, the, these Edomites, I right, did to us, uh, we're gonna receive, we're gonna receive double for, man. Because does say the Bible, man, it says rewarded double, man, even as she rewarded you. Uh. Yeah, we'll, uh, I'm gonna finish off our, finish off the revelation, but we get that second Ezra four also that you mentioned. Uh, uh, revelations eight, uh, eleven and eighteen, and the nations were angry, and thy wrath is come, and that the time of the dead that they should be, uh, be judged, and that thou shouldest give reward unto thy servants the prophets, and to the saints, and them that fear thy name, small and great. But this is the key point, and shouldest destroy. And shouldest destroy them which destroy the earth, man. And we're going to get that in second edges, man. Because these people are destroying the earth, man. Pollutions in all, uh, 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 in all time high, man. This, this man puts chemtrails on your air, man. Chemicals, hey. rat poison in your air. That Every time you come out, you br you're breathing out, man. The animals, man, they, they, they got uh, 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 feminine uh, uh, drugs in the water. All right, the, yep. the, these these fishes are out of course. This man, put fluoride in your water, bro. All right, the, these but sea whales, all these all oh, big fish are 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 are, 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 are 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 on the shores of the ocean, man, with a bunch of uh, trash in their, and plastic in their stomach, man. Yep. yep. We got uh, uh, whales beaching themselves, killing themselves, because the whale the, the 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 ocean is all messed up. It, it, this is all sea under the over the rule under the rule of Esau Edom, the so-called white man. That's what happens, man. This man only want is his only concern is filling his belly, man. And that's who you then that's who you you you, you so called blacks, Latinos, and Native Americans, the wicked of our people, want to rule over you, man. Y'all love this man. It's time to wake the fuck up, man. The second measure is four and twenty eight. But as concerning the things there wherefore thou askest me, I will tell thee. For the evil is sown, but the destruction thereof is not yet come. If therefore that which is sown be not turned upside down, if the place where the evil is sown pass not away, then cannot it come that is sown with good. All right. So a, the, the, this wickedness in the earth has to be uh, rooted out, man. For for the nation of Israel could be established, man. Huh? Yeah. That that wicked root got to be pulled out, man. You can't plant nothing good uh, uh, next to evil seed, man. Right. It needs to be done away with, man. So you know. we look for new heavens and new earth when it, we're in it dwelling righteous, man. That's it, bro. So. Shit, well, we'll finish off with that scripture. Calm. You know? It's, um... <clears throat> Second Peter's... Uh, Second Peter's, chapter 3, verse 10. But the day of the Lord will come as a thief in the night, in the which the heavens shall pass away with great noise, and the elements shall melt with fervent heat. The earth also and the works that are therein shall be burnt up, man. The, the, evil, the evil that's sown, man. The works that are therein exactly. shall be burnt up. Exactly, man. Seeing then all these things shall be dissolved, what manner of person are ye to be in all holy conversation and godliness, man? And, you know, this for us in the truth and those who wake up, man. You know, we got to seek unto you how about Shemir al daily, man. Conduct, man. You know, should, uh, you know, speaking to myself first and foremost, man. Uh, verse 12. Looking for and hasting unto the coming of the day of Yahweh, wherein the heavens being on fire shall be dissolved, and the elements shall melt with fervent heat. That's right. It says, Nevertheless, we according to the promise look for new heavens and new earth, wherein dwelleth righteousness, man. This is according to the promise, man. The promise that was given to Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, man. That's it, the man. Israelites. So, the kingdom of heaven is the kingdom of Israel, man. All right. Which is the king? Which is the king of Yahweh Shai, man? Because we're gonna join heirs with him. That's it, so, man. hey, uh, you know. Yeah. Come. So with that, man, I hope y'all brothers were edified. The spirit part, Yahweh by Shimi Yahweh Shai. Come. Call Halal La Yahweh by Shimi Yahweh Shai. Hey, call Halal Yahweh by Shimi Yahweh Shai, man. Double honors to the apostles of Great Millstone Come. and salutations to the Akim again, pushing his work in truth and sincerity. You know, may we endure to the end. Come. All right. So the next time, man, we say Shalom. Shalom, man, and a Baba Bob. Baba Bob.